What's going on, gang? It's Daniel here for Joe, and I'm here with Starboy Jude Bellingham. What's going on, bro? I'm all good, thank you. Just here at the Sports Personality of the Year, so yeah, really enjoyed the night. Amazing. You you were part of Team of the Year. How did that feel? Yeah, you know, real honour to even be involved with uh, the, the national team and obviously to pick up the award. I think uh, they deserved it, um, all the lads and the staff, so yeah. And, and you're part of that, bro. You absolutely deserved it and yeah. you've achieved so much already, but there's plenty more to come, my guy. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah. I just got to keep doing what I'm doing and stay focused. But listen, man, we're not here for the generic football <laughs> chat and the, yeah, the lads deserve the three points <laughs> stuff. We're going to play a bit, a few games and that. And I want to see, I want to see what kind of guy you are. All right, these, yeah. all so right. The first one's called Five Aside. Okay. Okay. So I think I know this question. You're choosing your ultimate five aside, but you're in, you're in it, okay. but in, based on the letters F, I, V and E. So I'm going to tell you what they mean in five. So F in, f uh, in five stands for fearless. Mm. I stands for intelligent. V stands for vibe. And E stands for elegant. So I want you to pick four people to join you <sighs> in a five-a-side team. That is a good question. So let's, man. Go, let's go for fearless. When I, when I say fearless, who goes straight into the team based on just being a warrior? I'd prob Players I've played with? Or yeah, well, any. All time? Yeah, all time, bro. Whoever, whoever's in your mm. mind. I'll go with players I've played with, you know. Sure. I'll go with Erling. <laughs> Machine. Good start. But I just think, you know, he doesn't care who he's playing against. He doesn't, uh, really. You know, what stage it is. Just goes out there and does his thing. He's not, not scared of being himself. And that's something I really admire about him. His Dortmund record is crazy. His yeah. Champions League record is crazy. I don't, I don't really know how he continues yeah. to reach those yeah, levels. Yeah, he's a he machine. Does. But and he'll, keep it, he'll keep it going for the next 15 years. I have no doubt. Amazing, amazing. And um, the next one, I, intelligence. Mm. So who's going in based on... Just being an all-round football smart. intelligence. Yeah. Ooh. You know what? I'm stuck between Phil Foden <sighs> and Marco Royce. I, I, I go Marco just because he's my captain. Well, well, talk to me about that yeah. because I know I, well, we all rate Marco yeah, really yeah. highly. I think he's I, one of them players you kind of have to rate. Don't sure, you? sure. You know, if, I mean, if you play FIFA, you're rating, <laughs> yeah, but, yeah. You, you know, know, you I know. know. Sometimes it's a bit out there to to look at players from the German league, but what he's done there and you know how good he is, I think you know. He's had injuries and stuff that's kind of stopped his like physical um, dominance. But, sure. You know, when you look how he plays the game, how smart he is, the positions that he picks up. You know, I think that's what edges him in a lot of games and, and what what helps him. You know, create the deciding moments for us. But I genuinely see a lot of respect from a lot of the young guys yeah, when yeah. it comes to him. Like even Erling Haaland just looks at yeah, Royce in everything. Everyone and just respects him. him. Everyone respects him. But it's not like because we have to unjustified yeah, respect yeah, yeah, yeah. and you know he respects all of us young players old players he looks after us so much so yeah he deserves every bit of respect that incredible he gets. Yeah. all right now moving on to vibe this is an important one I, I, I reckon i know who you're gonna but i'm gonna let okay, you okay yeah, i think okay shout, shout on three all right one, one two, two three, three. sancho yeah. oh, oh you said Jaden. Yeah, i said sancho come yeah. on g yeah yeah definitely. All right, so talk, talk to me about that relationship that you guys have. yeah I'm, i got there and from the first day he was just looking after me making sure i was always all right and did he know. hook you up with the barber when he was there to be fair yeah, no, he, he kind of got his guy back from England when he could and... Uh, Jaden, yeah. come on, Jaden. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, his vibe uh, unmatched in the game, I think. I think, you know, the way he goes about his business, he plays with a style, sure. off the pitch he has a style, so yeah. South London, born and bred, yeah, and he took the yeah, ball exactly. into the streets. I wouldn't know what London's about. But <laughs> oh, one, yeah, two, one, yeah, one yeah, boy, yeah, innit? Yeah, come exactly, on. man. But uh, yeah, he's uh, got a great vibe and really positive. You sure. know, I think it... It does rub off on a lot of the players that, you know, you know, I went to Dortmund quite quiet and, you know, you get to know everyone, but his vibe definitely helps you come out your shell a lot sooner. Sick, sick. All right, so we've got Jude Bellingham, we've got Erling Haaland, Marco Royce, Jaden Sancho. Yeah, it's just now the there's only one that, year, now, there's, now there's elegance. What are we going for with elegance? You know what, I'll go with Zidane. I know I've Oof. obviously not played with him. But He's, he threw Zizo, yeah, Zizo into I'll the mix. I'll just change my own rules. Woo! I do what I want. Um, yeah, Zidane, definitely. I just I can't stop watching clips. Have you seen minute. the compilation of him just taking first? Honestly, touches? he's probably he's probably my favourite midfielder. Him and Gerard are probably neck and neck. But yeah, I've, I've been watching a lot of Zidane recently, based he, on recommendation. Oh, it's just Zizou's surreal. got a bit of an air about him that I'll do what I want. Yeah, yeah, and it looks amazing. Yeah, yeah. It's just I know you talk about elegance. You know, there's players that score a goal a game and assist, but I think you know. People have forgotten about like the beautiful side of football where you know it's not all about stats and you can just sit and watch someone and I think there's no one that was better than him really in terms of that. Amazing, amazing. Well, listen, bro, that was a mad team. Yeah. That's like the first one I've done with these. I, yeah. I, I, I don't know how people are going to come with a, yeah. a more correct yeah, five-a-side. Yeah, yeah. So I thanks think, for that, my guy. that's up there, yeah.